My name is Scott Ackerman, and I'm a radiation oncologist here in Jacksonville, Florida. In my practice of radiation oncology, I see lots of cancers, and I see a lot of colorectal cancers. And patients ask me, what can I do to prevent colorectal cancer? You know, they, actually, they come to me, they already have rectal cancer or colon cancer, but they have their husbands or their wives with them or their kids, and, and there is a hereditary component to colorectal cancer. It's, it's common in families. Um, and there are some genes, actually, that are associated with it. It's not, not as strong a family uh, connection as, as certain breast cancers, but there's a strong family uh, hereditary factor in colorectal cancer. So people want to know, what can I do to avoid colorectal cancer? Well, the big thing is diet. I mean, that's really the really thing we can control. And what I advocate for my patients and their families is to, is to make sure they eat a good, uh, well-rounded, high-fiber diet. We have found that people on a high-fiber diet have a lower risk of colon cancer and rectal cancer than those people that eat, you know, just a lot of meats, uh, a lot of things that are, that, are, that, are, that are low in fiber. And also, if you maintain a healthy diet and, and, and are a healthy person, which you'll be if you're eating a high-fiber diet, if you were to get cancer and need to go through chemo or surgery or radiation therapy treatments, you're able to do it better because your body is in good shape. You're able to go through the treatments without any interruptions in treatment. You're able to recover from surgery that much more quickly. You're able to tolerate the radiation therapy treatments that much better. And so I certainly advocate a healthy lifestyle, a healthy diet, and appropriate cancer screening to diagnose cancer early.